I went out last night for date night and um, we went to karaoke and I'm going to insert a clip of this dude on stage. I hope it, it's, it's like he did Ramstein. anybody in the bar other than him and his girlfriend knew who Ramstein is look him up if you don't already know who they are but he did pretty good and he did all the German words he you know instead of singing they put American lyrics out but he did the German words it was freaking amazing but today was um sleeping day because I was out very late very late um but just a little while ago, I went to dinner with my friend Heather and her kids and my son and I, and um, we went grocery shopping after, and if you don't know this already, if you've been following me, you do know, my favorite scent from Bath & Body Works is pink chiffon. I don't know if you can see it. Pink chiffon, okay? Well, they put it on the retired list, and they have not been having the body spray available online for a very long time and it smells like Jesus like I'm dead serious this is probably what Jesus smells like it smells that good it's like cotton candy vanilla and just ideal spring and summer scent okay and I'm telling you straight up every single time I wear this I get stopped and asked what I'm wearing every time Granted, I always kind of combine it with pink sugar perfume. But when I'm running errands, I don't put the perfume on. I only put this on. Okay. So it's got this awesome cotton candy-ishness. God, this is a terrible angle. Okay, anyway. Um, but they've got me in a panic because they retired it. And if you don't know much about Bath & Body Works, they, they retire things. And if they put it in the retired section, like they, they can just cancel a scent and they don't retire it. They just get rid of it. You know what I'm saying? But they retired her, which means you're supposed to only be able to get it online. You can still purchase, uh, usually shower gels, lotions, and body sprays still, but only in the retired section, online only. But like I said, they've been not having the sprays, which is making me nervous because it's my all-time favorite. And yes, I have six bottles for backups, but I don't care. Okay? I still panic. And I've been on a quest to find a dupe for it. Okay? Quest over. I have found it. Now, I will tell you one simple kind that is not exact dupe. It's a lot lighter. But if, if you can't get the dupe I'm about to show you. No. I'm about to show you the one that's it's okay, but it's not exact. And it's by Bodycology called Sweet Love, which is, it, they're saying like the scent is sweet florals and whipped cream. I would say pink chiffon. I told you the like cotton candy, but I mean, icing, you know, that kind of scent, just sweet awesomeness, but not overpowering. Okay, that's what it is. It's just beautiful. This is okay, but I would say it's a lot... It's like a couple steps down, you know what I'm saying? If, if pink chiffon's at the top of the stairs, this is halfway up the stairs. You know what I'm saying? Not perfect, but okay. I will use it though, okay? I have found the perfect dupe. Perfection. Nearly, nearly identical, okay? Nearly identical. You ready for this shit? Okay. First of all, body ecology can be purchased at Walmart, maybe other places, but Walmart is where I got it from. Following what I'm about to show you, okay. <laughs> this can be purchased at Walmart, and I don't know anywhere else, but maybe other places, okay? I, I nearly passed out in Walmart when I smelled this because I looked online in like forums, 
asking, I need a, you know, I need a dupe for Pink Chiffon. What am I going to do? And they get, this one forum suggested this one and the one I'm about to show you. They are so right on this one, okay? It's by Body Fantasies. Pink Vanilla Kiss. You looking at that? Pink Vanilla Kiss. It is identical to Pink Chiffon. Now, lasting, I don't know. I just bought it tonight, okay? But I'll be honest with you. When I, even when I wear Pink Chiffon, I bring this with me and reapply every couple hours. You know what I'm saying? And when I put it on, yeah, I spray it all over my body, okay? And my hair everywhere. It smells that good, okay? So I don't know if this is going to be like the same type of consistency that's going to last as long as that one does. I'm not going to lie to you. The minute I can't smell something anymore, I spray more. That's how I roll because I like to smell good. You know what I'm saying? So I'm going to bring this to work with me all weekend and I will let you know how it worked out. But I am telling you I have dudes stopping me, wanting me to tell them what it is and then they take notes so they can go buy it for their girl. It's that good. So I am pleased to announce the pink vanilla kiss is identical. I'm so happy. So I bought three bottles because it's all I had in the store. I will buy more because when I like something, I like it. I don't want to run out of it. And don't worry, I use it all, okay? I'm so happy that I found a replacement. You know what? I deserve, I deserve. Oh yes, thank you, Jesus. It's so good. It is so friggin' good. I'm in love with you. So there you go. That's my little nugget. So really quick, I just, I did want to say that uh, Body Ecology and um, Body Fantasies, they both make a cotton candy spray. It's, it's a lot sweeter. I'm more of a cotton candy musk-ish. You know what I mean? I like, I like it like it's just a little bit lighter. I don't want to be so sweet cotton candy, which they are. But let me tell you something. They are still good. And I have, I have both. I have the Body Ecology one and I do have the Body Fantasy ones that's in my purse. Um, but for some reason, the Pink Chiffon, Bath and Body Works, and Pink Vanilla Kiss, Body Fantasies. This is more of what I would say is similar to cotton candy, icing, vanilla side of the house where they're straight up, cotton candy is like wicked sweet. And it is still pretty, it's still, it's still good. It is. It is good. I love a sweet cotton candy smell. Cotton candy can never go wrong. You know what I'm saying? It's fabulous. You know what I thought I would show you? If eventually, I will put the guy that I've been dating on the vlogs. I will. You're going to see him at some point. I'm just weird about that. But can we talk about what a nice person he is? You want to know what he's... The last... three because the other one was for my birthday he bought me stuff for my birthday he bought me sneakers he bought me perfume he bought me two hundred dollars worth of nail polish you know that was that was all he needed to do and that just sent me over the edge okay he's a very 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 not selfish person i like this but the last three date nights we had we kind of only have date night one one day a week that is my fault that is my life but we're working with it but each time that I've met him out, well, we meet somewhere and then get into one car. It's just easier. And because he lives, well, I'm not going to get into it. There's a reason why he just doesn't come here and pick me up. There's a reason. A good reason. But when I've gotten into his car the last three date nights, okay? So each one is one thing. Okay, I'm going to show you all three. This is what I've gotten into the car too. This is how you know I'm like, oh my God, he is a keeper. Okay. John Barber Toast, Artesian Pure. It is a men's cologne, but I like it. I wear it. He bought me a 4.2 fluid ounce bottle. Not necessary. Then, obviously he pays attention to everything I say because I don't remember really even talking much about this. But the following week, Coco Mademoiselle by Chanel was sitting in the seat. I love this. And I actually, I don't even own any Chanel perfumes. This is my first one. I have like little samples, okay? So right here, I was like, I'm really liking it, you know what I'm saying? This week, I got into the car to Chanel's Coco Noir. Is he not a nice person or what? 
And he knows I have an obsession with Smell Me Goods, perfumes, and things like that. So he has increased my collection greatly. And I hate talking about dudes. I get all weird. Let's not even talk about it. But anyway, wasn't that very nice? It was very nice. I told him once about YouTube. This is like... which is good because I'm not ready for him to be all up in my YouTube world, you know what I mean? But, why did I just tell you that? Ah, oh, whatever. Yeah, I thought, I thought I would just share with you what a nice person he is. I mean, you gotta buy, buy me stuff to make me like you. That's not, that's not what I'm saying. I'm not gonna turn it away though either. But, no. I think he's a keeper. Other than that, he's awesome to me, too. Okay, I'm, I don't want to talk about this anymore. I'm not, we're not going there. Hello, everyone. I have not... not wait, first of all, let, let me just tell you about how I cannot even see myself in this, this so bright out. Just taking the dog out. And see if I can put this down and talk like a normal person. Probably not. Not with going down into double chin pose, so we won't do that. I in the mood. Um, I haven't vlogged the last couple of days because of work, even though I said I probably would. I didn't, because I've been in a pissy mood. It's windy, and I am hoping you are not hearing lots and lots of wind against the microphone. Um, pissy mood. <sighs> that scale is not friggin' moving at all. And it's frustrating because I had to bug me. Because I am, I am not cheating, food-wise. I am not, and I am going to the gym, and I am going. I am going more than two days a week, so I don't get it. It's friggin' annoying big wind. Sorry. I gotta get one of those like covers for the microphone. Um, so yeah, there's that. Oh my God. I have to show you guys this ice cream that is like a high protein ice cream. I, I, I'm sure y'all already know what it is, but I tried it the other day because I wanted ice cream and I wanted ice cream that wasn't going to be bad for me. And uh, I think it's called Halo Top. When, when I go back in the house, I will show you it. For the love of Jesus, it is that good. And I am not kidding. It is that good. It tastes like regular high sugar ice cream. And it's not bad. Granted, the, like, the number on the front of the container is like the full calories if you ate the whole container. I don't do that. You know what I mean? I like the look of it as, as, a, as like a quick, sweet treat. But I am shocked at how good it is. And I think if you were to eat the entire container, the carb levels would be wow. Hot poop. Um, other than that, I don't have very much going on. I can't see a damn thing. This was my last day of work of my full-time job. Yesterday was my son's last final exam slash regents. Let's talk about how they don't provide proper busing during the regent schedules. Hello, uh, hmm. These are high school students. Not everyone can drive. Not everyone has parents home that can transport said students. They provide a ride home. You can take the elementary school bus home, but the getting there as if you have like a afternoon exam. Oh well, find a ride, literally. Luckily for my child, his mother is off Tuesday through Friday. However, the exam on Monday, I had to schedule myself out early from work to provide a ride. Not that I care. I mean, I enjoyed getting out early, who are we kidding? But still. Better planning schools, good lord. Anyway, 
totally had something more I wanted to talk about, hence why I brought this out with me and now I can't remember. <sighs> I'm tired and I suck when I'm tired, so I'm gonna leave you alone. Jeez. All sorts of commotion going on around here. I'll talk to you a little bit. I just got done recording my summer shred video and just seriously look at my neck. Are these ever gonna go away? I hate you. I hate you. I want them off my neck. To me, I think everybody thinks I have hickeys or some contagious disease. And, and I have neither. Really, Poop? You're gonna do this to me right now? I don't know if you just saw me cleaning out. I'm already running late, you know what I'm saying? I'm already running late. And I woke up a little bit slept in my alarm. So I'm late for side hustle. So I'm already stressed. I gave my son. Son bitch, okay. I gave my son a list yesterday of the things I, that better be done by the time I wake up. One of those things, two actually of those things are not done. As soon as I get home from side hustle in the gym, I'm gonna ground his ass. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna ground it, I'm gonna take that phone because I gave you a list and my lists aren't long. So there's no, you wanna know what his, his list was? Seriously, you wanna hear the list? The list was, he just, he, he just had to clean his bedroom. That wasn't part of his list. That was that was last week's list. It didn't get done until two days ago. So he already lost his phone for three days. You know what I'm saying? So he cleaned his room. By the way, taking his... I just went the wrong way. For the love of God, I cannot talk and drive. Okay. Brenda, in case you didn't say my, my seatbelt's on. Okay, it's under my arm. I don't like it across my friggin' neck. Okay? So zip it. <laughs> anyway, okay. His list was return to me because I keep all my cleaning products and things in a, in a you know in a spot, and I'm anal about my cleaning products, okay? Because I'm a cleaner for side hustle. So I'm anal retentive about cleaning products because it's got my favorites and I don't like to mess with for very long, so. And one of my cleaning products I don't I don't use anywhere. I keep that for my home, myself at home, and it's called. Well, you guys probably heard it, Method from. You can get Method just about anywhere, but one time I could only find it at Target. But I love Method, okay? The bamboo multi-surface smelling one, and the lavender, my favorites, okay? So he took lavender into his room, which lavenders, lavender and bamboo are like my top. Like, don't you dare mess with, or I will kill you. Products. He took lavender in his room, but that was okay because, you know, he was cleaning his room. All right. I let him use my best products. I took that. Big roll of paper towel. And I'm anal about my paper towels because at home, I only use Viva because they're the best. But not Viva for like everyday kitchen tasks, if that makes any sense to you. Cleaning is Viva. I just love it. Or rags, to be honest with you. Anyway, why am I telling you this? It doesn't matter. I let him take the Viva, that's what I'm trying to say though. Because normally I would've been like, oh, go down to the kitchen and get your paper towels there. And I was like, no, but, no, but I let him take Viva. And he took my, in my bedroom, in the little corner, I keep a little, like, you know, what's it called? A, a little, 
brush, little tiny brush about this big with the matching dustpan that they click it together. You know what I mean? It's because I got a dog crate in my room and you know, dog hair man, dog hair dander that needs to be swept up daily. So I keep that in my room, right? It's been gone since he started cleaning. So on my list for yesterday, I always make a list when I come home on Tuesday and the last day of my work weekend, because by then I'm so tired and then the more angry I get when I see things not done. So that's list day. Those two things were return them to where they belong. Get your dirty dishes to the kitchen. One moment. Get your dirty laundry into the laundry basket and get your school supplies that you just brought home because school just ended out of my damn car. Guess what didn't get done? The dirty dishes and now the school supplies. So there's gonna be another few days with no phone. So if you're friends with my kid, he won't be talking because I got his phone. Okay. Anyways, I'm at side hustle, I gotta go. I just wanted to waste six minutes of your time with information. I shall talk to you soon because I'm already late for this.